Let's say hypothetically in theory, if I were to shoot a human being with a 12 gauge loaded buck shotgun to the cranium and it did, should there be an instant death? So why when I shoot a measure on the forehead with mute shotgun, did his head not turn into mist, but instead shrug it off as a half his face wasn't gone and made me a Swiss cheese with the LMG? <laughs> <laughs> bro why did you describe it so well oh my god <laughs> bro that was passionate to be explaining that <laughs> bro <laughs> oh that's funny bro listen as funny that is that is just copium either you missed your shot it's like 99% you missed your shot 1% you were lagging but if you didn't have over like 70 ping then you just missed. It's just copium. I think it's copium. Anyways. <laughs> oh, uh, made you in a Swiss cheese with an LMG. Because <laughs> that one death costed you the game and dropped your rank by two ranks. How did it drop you two ranks? I don't think that's possible. That's not possible. Okay, now, you're, now it's definitely copium. You can't lose more than two ranks. Even in rank 2.0. That's just copium. Yeah, yeah, this is, yeah. <laughs> All right. Now we'll start with the kids. Dude, I, I could do, I could literally set up Oregon by myself. Like, I can set up with my eyes closed so there's no map to reach. Secure the area. Keep the bombs protected. Down to 10 seconds. Okay. Five seconds left. Oregon is very simple. I think everybody really knows how to play it, but I'll do it for the people in the back that don't know. Okay. Stop. Oh, I don't want, I want to pronounce this, but stop doing this. Stop doing this. This is a bad shield. Uh, there really is no, like, there's no reason for it to be here. If anything, it works both ways. Second, put your shield further back here. Or if you're ever going to put it on a doorway, don't put it like this, but instead put it like, give space. This way you can put Jaeger ADSs and protect the shield a lot better. But you can either do the attic shield or you can do this shield if you were to do the setup. Otherwise, reinforce the master wall here. I like, I think it's better if you pick like Oryx or like Bailiff or any kind of um, setup. Okay, so you can either make this head holes or rotate is fine. I think head holes is that way in case they do get controllers rotate, they can't use it. But. Rotation is also like a full rotation is optional too. Make big window holes. That way you can see if anybody's walking up white, but remember it can work both ways. Uh, you want to make foot holes here. This way when someone hops in big window, they can't expose themselves. But just know that you will get shot from there. So you gotta be careful of like the angle like this. Make this a crouch rotate. Crouch or running rotates up to you. Crouch is just, you know, for mobility reasons. And then, so these trophy holes are optional. I don't think you should do trophy holes if, uh, okay. you shouldn't do trophy holes if you're like not holding trophy. It's just going to work against you. So fully reinforces off. I'm still thinking of someone said turn. <laughs> I shock at this guy boy play and Mesha turns me into Swiss G. Uh. <laughs> I can imagine that. I can imagine you're just shocking him point blank when he's on the camera, he gets off and his he just lights you up. <laughs> Only someone that would complain will make that descriptive of a statement because they can't accept the fact it's copium uh otherwise oh also if you ever see me do this this is all for hearing glass on the windows also shoot the radio very very crucial otherwise that's pretty much all you have to do to set up all the utility is up to you get your devices there and uh yeah let's move on to the next one
why you have radios to play music. Dude, they gotta take them out, man. Always shoot the radio. If you don't shoot the radio, you're trolling. It's not even like, unless it's the consulate radio. Oh, the, wait, didn't I just time this guy out? Oh, it's a different person. Bro, I'm just gonna start banning these people. In Villa, when I do the side set for Villa, I will. Okay, laundry is very, very crucial. If you don't have this laundry set up, then you might struggle for the most part. Rotates on the left side. Don't reinforce the fully off unless you agree your team to close off elbow. You should... Okay, I'll, I'll tell you when you should reinforce it off later in the explanation. Remember, don't put your shield like this. Put your shield a little bit further back. That way you have a lot more room to work with and you put ADSs on the side. Head holes, not vault holes. Be careful, don't make holes like this. You can do it really far away, but then you can just like one vault them. If, okay, listen, if there are no holes like this on a lot of other maps too, then there's no pressure. They're gonna see these reinforced off and they're gonna have no pressure. What if you have a frost? Dude, we're not in year one anymore. If, like, if you were to put a shield on the door, like, there's just no reason to. Like, first of all, the shield's gonna get destroyed by people. Two, it, it's just, don't, just don't do it. it. Like, people will know to shoot below them already. Like, it, frost is really just ghost pressure at this point. You can't really, like, make a frost trap. Like, uh, okay, you could make, uh, holes i guess if you want so you can see into a tower like this me personally this one's already enough and uh if i'm gonna be playing tarp and they're gonna get the hatch open then i want this one reinforced off so that's up to you next we have the freezer holes so you notice how all these holes are only head holes they're not rotate holes they're head holes because that way you can hold you can extend your your map control you can extend your map control. Um, make the rotate on the far side like here. That way they can't really see it from the rotate. But it's really doesn't matter too much. Because most of the time you end up doing this anyways. To see the little pixel here. Uh, holes left or right side. I don't think it matters too much. I think right side is more preference though. You seem to get good? Yes indeed man. It's never been a time to get good in this game. Otherwise, all three um, reinforce this freezer one, obviously. Then we get all three of the hatches. Make sure you guys understand who gets all the hatches. But one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three. And that's it. You save the last reinforcement after you can all through the hatches. You reinforce off elbow if you lose his shield and it's like pretty deep into the round and you no longer have control of elbow. Obviously, don't, you know, pull a plane and. Reinforce your teammate off. <laughs> Don't do that without his consent. <laughs> you know what? I should do that. Next time I'm playing with Senvale and he's playing elbow, I'm going to definitely reinforce him off. <laughs> I'm going to do that. That's because it's Senvale. What am I doing? A Fionator? Isn't that like the, the genie that predicts everything? Okay, on to the meeting. I don't think I'm going to do dining. Actually, I'll do dining just, just for the one time. Just for the one time, I might do it. But I'm going to change the settings that's not too long. Okay. Sunville would rage? Nah. He, ne he never rages at me. He won't rage at me. I know him too long. He, he's not going to do that. And it's ranked. Unless it's like, like literally a 7-7 seven, seven FPL or like overtime match point, he's not gonna- And I'm not gonna troll, I mean I'll do it like if we're up- I, I would definitely do it though. <laughs> it's not even to piss him off, I just know it'll just like, it, it'll just be funny. Do it in FPL? Maybe, we'll see. Okay, we're gonna go meeting, sorry I'm being distracted. Having too much fun. Okay, next. Security holes. Two rotates. 
Uh, this is optional if you want to make footholds here and then reinforce the right to have more pressure and tower. But that's totally up to you. Otherwise, fully reinforce it off. Doing a 4-4. Four, four. Yeah, we'll only lose like 9 elo though. And another thing is, if I even if I were to do that to him, he would probably just start running at the guy bunker and just do send bell peaks, send bell things. Okay. Uh, you can open this hatch for personal preference. If you were not going to play up top, then I'd re I recommend reinforcing it off because it can work both ways. Reinforce both of the split walls here. I like to put a Bieber here. Okay, next. Uh, I would have some head holes here that way you can see in the dining. Reinforce a single. Okay, so you have two options that you can do. One, you can reinforce off both small tower walls, but you really don't need to. It's just like... No one's really gonna really matter anyways. But it's optional if you have any time. Uh, you would have a rotate here. This is like only if you're roaming. Obviously use a reinforcement here if you want, but always get the T2 walls. This way they don't get a rotate in a tower. And then if you have extra two walls, I mean, meeting is really just a roam, a roam heavy one. You can get away with roaming a lot because like this whole, like you need a roam like, well, at least a little bit of the second floor and very horizontally. Just add a lot of pressure because most of the time they just want to get this wall open. So, you know, just roam. Understand there's a lot of ratty points, but just keep your gun up and you'll be fine. Why extend it to security? Because... I mean, it's kind of the norm, but it's like another rotation device instead of have to always rotate out to here or rotate out there. But this is like a, a quick way into Z Hall right here. It's a quick rotate. It's a quick retake as well. What utility would you put in there? You don't need to put utility inside here. If anything, maybe barbed wire. But, you know, you should be having control of like this area until like late round. But yeah, this is kind of just like a an extra piece of map control. I mean, like I said, like this hallway, like you Five should be able to retake this hallway pretty easily, you know? So yeah, just, you know, just roam. I would, that's the only tip I can give you on this map of this bomb site is just to roam. I remember actually in, in competitive, I would play Echo here and we would have a whole setup in there, but obviously this is not comp. Okay, last bomb site. Oh, we're on attack. This is the last bomb site here. Oh well, yeah, for the most part, you can, you can already, I bet you a lot of you guys already know how to set up Oregon. Oregon's a map that has, doesn't change in a long time. It's very, very easy. But if you make the wrong rotations, then go wrong. Do I have a charm? Unfortunately, I do not, man. Hopefully soon, though. Last one's kitchen dining. Okay, like this is like even more like. This one is like. Secure the bomb. Ten seconds left. They're, they're really like, I don't think any team has a consistent way of attacking this except for like small tower over. But let's reinforce these two walls here. Am I still guessing ranks? No, we just finished doing that. Big head holes here. The reason you should pick meeting over dining is because dining is very one-sided. You can see, as you can see, it's like you're kind of there's not a lot of map control you can really work with. Make a rotate in the bathroom. I think it's on the left side here. But yeah, make head hole or uh, foot holes here, and then reinforce this because you want to extend. This is like elbow on basement. Put a shield right here or like right here. Careful of this window you can get shot from, but shield or something to hold it. Aruni gates would be nice. You don't need to hold small tower though. Let them have small tower and you want to hold on to dining and to here as long as you can. And eventually you back up, make a rotate here as well. Reinforce both of these walls back here. Yeah, it's a hard bomb side to hold even in competitive. It's a hard one to deal with. It's pretty attacker sided. But in the right hands, it can kind of be good. The hardest thing about dining against a good team is that they hold on in the showers with their lives. So, make a rotate in security. Um, same thing, you should have control of White Hall. You shouldn't lose control of like this area, unless it's late round. 
Which one I go to if you have Oryx, Le uh, Jaeger, Doc, or Legion? Probably. I mean, honestly, they're all they're all good picks. I think Jaeger's the most important one out of all of them. But in most scenarios in ranked, you don't really. Like I said, reinforce these walls, and yeah, you just keep the enemy in front of you. Watch for any kind of backstabs, but you want to try to hold showers. If you can find yourself holding showers properly, then you're going to be a big problem. So, dining is like TDM. Just play your life and just learn. It's fine. You're like, but I guarantee you're not going to go against the bomb site anytime soon. All right, thank you guys for watching the Oregon uh, site setup video. This should help you on YouTube. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.